Hi everyone, this is Dave from Daily Tech TV with another Q&A session for you. This is a brilliant question from Stingo's Tech Review. Why does my Mac use more RAM the longer it has been turned on, even though I have the same or less running? That is a brilliant question. And what you're referring to is the amount of RAM or memory that the applications and the operating system uses on your Mac. Now what happens is you turn on your Mac for the first time, for example. It boots up fresh, loads various things into memory. Then you might start up something like Photoshop, maybe your email client, maybe something for Twitter. And then you're gonna close down Photoshop. And what happens is that when Photoshop closes down, it's meant to, in an ideal world, release all of the memory that it was using. In reality, it doesn't release all of the memory. Some of the memory gets um, sort of uh, chopped up into tiny bits and it releases all of the segments apart from some of the middle ones, so it sort of fragments the memory. And what you end up with is with not enough continuous memory for things to run smoothly. Now, if you imagine if you've had your Mac switched on for maybe like I do, I don't shut mine down for maybe two weeks or three weeks at a time, and you've been waking it up from sleep, loading things up, doing tasks, over a period of a week, in my case, you could have used 20 or 30 or maybe even more different applications. And all of those applications are gonna leave little traces of things in the memory and not clear out the memory properly. And that's why, over that period, your Mac will end up using more and more memory even though you're supposedly running less. You might only be running one application and it's running really slow. And the only way to sort that out is obviously to do a restart and then that clears out everything and you're starting afresh. So great question, I hope that's explained it properly to you as well. It's just to do with a, a fragmentation thing and applications not releasing back the memory properly. So, if you've got any new questions, leave them in the comments below. How do you find your Mac running? Do you leave it running for weeks at a time or do you shut down at the end of each day? I'd be really interested to hear from you. Comment section below please guys and girls. Leave me some new questions as well and I will see you all in the next one.